fans of the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy will know only too well that the answer to the ultimate question of life, the universe and everything is 42. But for most of us, I guess, life here on planet Earth all too often resembles a confusing mix of smoke and mirrors. Even the Bible tells us that life is meaningless. Did you know that? But does the word of God really teach us that life is without meaning? Well, no, of course not. The, the English word we have in our Bibles rendered as meaningless is the Hebrew word hevel, hevel. And that is better translated as ephemeral, temporary, transient, a kind of vanity, if you like. It's also pictured as smoke. Now, smoke can look physical, but just try grabbing hold of it. And so the patterns that smoke take swirl and change like a wave of the hand. And if we're surrounded by smoke, caught up in some kind of fog, then we can feel lost and fear that there's no way out. But certain things are certain in this uncertain life. Our time here is relatively short, however much of an impression we like to think we make. The mountains and the rivers were there before us, and they'll be here long after we've gone. And indeed all of us at some point will physically die. And whilst bad things happen to good people, also rather annoyingly, good things happen to bad people. Life is a confusing mix of smoke and mirrors. So if we build our lives on human foundations, then yeah, everything is ephemeral, here today, gone tomorrow. Now, living in God's world by obeying God's word does not guarantee us success, not at least in the way uh, the human world looks at it. But the Bible tells us that it's the right thing to do. Not only that, but if we overfill our lives with concerns and worries about the future, about what might or might happen tomorrow, then we're likely to miss out on the blessings of today. Was it not Jesus himself who said, do not worry about the things of tomorrow. Tomorrow has enough woes and worries of its own. Well, I don't know what you reckon, but surely it's worth a thought. But for now, do take care, stay safe, and as ever, thank you.